This is some hot news. All right, guys, I got a little bit of news here. This is the news I've been waiting on personally because I've been holding on to these 1080 G, uh, yeah, GTX 1080s for so long. It's time for me to upgrade. So now granted, I won't buy the Founders Edition cards or the ones made by NVIDIA. I will wait for the EVGA cards. Yeah, I shaved, I look a little different, but I'm still the same person here. We're getting back to some PC news and PC stuff because I've been doing a lot of camera stuff here lately, which is I want to do both. So we're going to try to keep this short and simple. So this card is huge. I'm going to put it on the screen here somewhere. But uh, this card is huge. It's a triple slot card. It's way bigger than the, 20, the 2080s. Um, it's got a huge heat sink. So that may be some heating issues. So guys, y'all may want to wait, see what the heating issues are like. Go for them third party cards and, and get like the EVGA because they've always had a better cooling solution. Now that's my recommendation. Yeah, I'm an EVGA fanboy, as you can tell above. So what? But I'm just saying, they've always had a better cooling solution or put yours on water when that becomes available. Now the, the big 12 pin, why change what works? The big 12 pin plug has been confirmed. It is gonna be on this card. The Seasonic's been shipping out adapter plugs. So just be prepared guys. It's, it's gonna be a little different this time around. Um, got a little bit of the pricing, which is what everybody is probably here for anyway. They're curious about the pricing. Uh, the 3090 is coming in at around $1,400, the 3080 at $800, 3070 at $600, and the 3060 at $400, which makes logical sense because that leaves room like the 3080 Super, the 3080 Ti, the 3070 Super, the 3070 Ti to fall in between these cards. Now, will there be a 3080 or a 3090 Ti or a 3090 Super? Who knows? We'll see how this plays out. But guys, I've been waiting on this card. It's exciting news. It's been linked all over the internet. Um, but I just figured I'd bring you guys a little video. This is the one I've been waiting on. I wanted to get that first that first GN of RTX out of the way. I want to try the RTX cards, and I want to try the 3090 RTX if it's not if it falls with the price range where it's at. It's very doable for me. But if it's way up there, like some have predicted before. Uh, two thousand dollar card, just uh, just a little too much for me. I'll probably go a little bit below that one, and go to the thirty eighty. But guys, y'all wanted to see some news. This is a little, I guess, Monday two minute news. So I figured you guys would enjoy it. Uh, tell me what you think below. Uh, is is this a card you're going to go to? Is this something you've been waiting for as well? So if you like hit thumbs up. If you ain't subscribed, subscribe, and we'll bring you some more news as soon as I get it, you can get to see you guys. So thank y'all, like, and subscribe.